Hey guys, welcome to Macintosh Weekly. And today in this video I'm gonna show how to install macOS Sonoma on an unsupported Mac. So before starting, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. And now, let's begin. For this guide, I'll be using Mac Mini 2014 model, which is unsupported since macOS Venture. Installing macOS Sonoma on unsupported hardware doesn't mean that you could get macOS Sonoma working on any Mac, there are certain limitations. To know whether your Mac is compatible or not, please check out the link provided under the video description. Also, before getting into the process, make sure to have a backup of your Mac, as a clean installation process requires erasing the drive. Now, for installing macOS Sonoma on unsupported hardware, you'll need an open core patcher for downloading the macOS Sonoma installer and creating the USB installer. Also, it will be needed for fixing the graphics and Wi-Fi. You can download open core patcher from the link under the video description. Make sure to download it from the link given under the video description, as this is the pre-release version, and you won't find it anywhere. Also, USB with a minimum 16 GB capacity is required. After downloading the open core patcher, open it. After it opens, click on Create macOS Installer, then click on Download macOS Installer. After the catalog loads, select macOS 14.0 Sonoma, then click on Download. Also, provide the administrative privilege whenever required. After you get this prompt, click on Yes, then select Install macOS Sonoma Installer. Now plug in your USB and, after the disk appears, click on Search for Disks again and, then select the disk and, proceed with the prompts. Once the USB installer is ready, you'll be notified. Now, click on Yes to install the open core to the disk. After the open core is built for your Mac, you'll be prompted with this option. Click on the Install to Disk option and, then from the list of disks, select your USB drive. After that click on its EFI partition. Enter password when prompted. After getting the reboot prompt, copy open core patcher to your USB, as the patcher will be needed later. On its startup manager, select EFI boot and press enter key and now select the macOS installer and press enter to boot. Now, select Disk Utility and, then erase the main drive instead of volume, with the following parameters. After erasing the drive, close Disk Utility. Now select Install macOS Sonoma and, click on Continue to proceed and, then continue with the installer. Here, select the disk you created and, then click on continue. Keep in mind that, during the installation process, your Mac may start several times, so don't worry about that.
As you can see, macOS Sonoma setup screen is here. Set up your Mac according to your preference. At the moment, you may feel a bit laggy. After reaching the Sonoma desktop, copy the open core patcher from USB and put it to the desktop. After it's copied, eject the USB and then open open core patcher. After opening the OpenCore patcher, click on the build and install OpenCore option. After the OpenCore is built for your Mac, you'll be prompted with this option. Click on the install to disk option and, then from the list of disks, select the drive on which macOS is installed and, after that click on a CFI partition. Enter password when prompted. After OpenCore is installed, click on the Reboot option and then restart your Mac to apply the changes. Here, select the EFI boot and then press Enter key and then boot to Mac. After booting back, again open OpenCore Patcher. After it opens, click on Post Install Root Patch. From the menu, click on the Start Root Patching option and proceed with all the prompts. Once you get this message, click on the Reboot option and restart your Mac.
And as you can see, macOS Sonoma has been successfully installed. Let me show you that the graphics, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth are fixed and are working on an unsupported Mac. So, that was it, hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching, and have a great day ahead.